Or two? Oh, well, I'm not going to win this game, am I? But he breaks them down into like one or two simple lines. But when people say, hey, Witty, got a strategy for you. First of all, you need to pick up two tones of agility. You need to be playing against Orc. You need to have an ally that has an undead shop. It's like, what the fuck, man? No, this is Lich and Ghoul Rush. It's the only way I can beat Night End. Preferred race is human, because I think they're the most fun and interesting. But they're also the hardest. And not just because they are actually harder to play than the other races, but also because they're the shittest. Human used to struggle versus Undead before the patch. Now it's really hard. I should have got... yeah, never mind. Did you aggro? Change a plan now, because he's going to think I'm going to be rushing. I always change my mind quite quickly on. That timing though, that skeleton just run out. I've got my hotkeys set up properly, so it's harder to do this than I'd like. Oh, 
I bow to your will. I am sworn to his Oh, he keeps coming though. So greedy to go for that goal. Makes sense. He's got no TP, has he? He's gonna try to buy the shredder, maybe. I think I lose too much here, maybe. I just need to buy a time anyway, because I've got the cigarettes coming up, so I don't have to fight this. Old stand again. Might not make much sense to creep this, but I need to get as many units as possible. Our town is 
What? What? <laughs> I mean, I had the advantage of random and I took it because he didn't know what race I was. If he knew I was undead, he most likely would have set himself up more for a, a race. That only made sense to me. I had all that gold and enough wood to whack down a whole bunch of towers here as well. And I got really lucky with the creep jacks, like creep jack after creep jack, or putting his heroes in bad positions. And that was it. What? <laughs> oh my god. All right. Well, let me just say this. Night End is a much better player than I am. And if we played again, he would easily crush me. This was very lucky. But I'll take it, because it counts, I guess. What? <laughs> that change of tactics really worked. Normally, that bites me in the butt when I say, Oh, I'm going to change my mind. I was going to go all in, but now he's seen me moving my lich up with that skeleton, because these skeleton scouts were really good. I was like, fine, I'll just... Take an expansion instead, but it actually made a lot more sense to do that because he was expecting me to come, so he probably would have been waiting around that area. But Lich and Ghouls can create that expansion really quickly, and I've got the Acolyte already set up to do it. And then I can put pressure on or defend it. Jeez. GG. Crazy. Crazy. All right, well, hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Make sure to thumbs up, subscribe, and comment. If you did, help support the channel. Oh, my goodness. Uh, that's that's a pretty big high I gotta say like I say he's a way he's like on so many levels above me and I only won because of cheese but it still feels good